Michigan fans, y'all are really, really, really <laughs> going to like Jordan Marsh. I think to me, when I watched this tape a couple months ago when I first, when I did my Michigan breakdown, y'all go ahead and check that video out. I may go ahead and link it somewhere. But when I did my breakdown of the Michigan 2024 class, it was about four or five players that really stuck out to me. And, 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 and Jordan Marshall was one of them. So let's take a look at his junior highlight tape. Really wish he would have made a senior highlight tape, but we don't got it, so we're going to work with what we got. So let's get into it. Six foot, 200 pounds. Now, these numbers are kind of, I don't know, I think some sites had them at like 5'10", 5'11", 195. So is an inch and a half really that much of a difference at running back? No, but it, there is some discrepancies there, unfortunately. Uh, you know, so, but, man, when I tell you I really enjoy this, man, like, this first play is butter. Like, look at this. He even, who, 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 he even got 24. I think Marshawn Lynch's number was 24. If I'm not mistaken, I don't know. <laughs> I should have researched that before I started, but look at that. He, he, he slipped the first tackle. Look at that. Whoop. First guy gone. Put his foot in the dirt, got north and south, boom. Now we got one, two, three, four people that could potentially make this play. Swoop, put your foot in the ground, make this guy look crazy, make these guys look stupid, make this, he don't even know where he at. You got one-on-one -on -one with this cornerback right here. He don't want none of that. He don't want none of that. He don't even want to be in this position. Whoop, gone, touchdown. 20 gonna try to get there, but he ain't gonna be able to do nothing. So, I gotta say, man, I really like... Uh, I want to say Marshawn Lynch, but I really like Jordan Marshall. Uh, his elusiveness, his physicalness, his ability to, you know, break those open field tackles. If the offense, you can break that line, break that plane, especially with that Michigan offensive line. Do you know what a kid like this can do behind that Michigan offensive line? Michigan, if they can't recruit nothing else, they can recruit the trenches. You know, I have my reservations about, you know, J.J. McCarthy and all that and you know, but that offensive line, that defensive line, hey, they're going to they gonna put some big boys on the field. Look at this. All you got to do is give him a crease. All he needs is a crease. He don't need much. I don't like all that show, but get, get your butt in the end zone. But uh, let's see what you do. Whoop. Look at that. He ain't supposed to break out of that. He's not supposed to get out of there. Set him up. Set him up. I don't even know what they're doing right here, but look at that. He. This is, this is some... Beast mode type things. I haven't like, like you know, say so like to me, he's a a great mix between Marshawn Lynch and Saquon Barkley. When I watch the tape, that's kind of what I see. That's what I kind of see. The Saquon Marshawn Lynch type runner. You know. Here we go. Look at that dragging the whole pile. Strong. At 200 pounds, 195, he's doing that. So, hey, man, we really like him. I, I, wanna, wanna know, I really want to know what y'all think about this kid because I think uh, very highly of him. I will link the full uh, highlight in the description below. I just wanted to introduce him to you guys. I think you guys struck it out the park. Really wish Georgia would have came and got this boy, but they didn't, and we got to live with that. And uh, y'all catch me on the next one. I'm out.